Uh, I also noticed this thing You're that, uh, yep. Mm -hmm. Back to the noticer. The dumbed down version of the ponder. We were talking earlier uh, in the pondering segment uh, about wearing glasses and appearing more intelligent, but you may need to leave them home for your next passport photo session. The State Department is reminding everyone that come November 1st, Wearing glasses is no longer allowed in passport photos. This they also wild. don't let you smile anymore. It depends. Yeah. It depends? Yeah. Some some people taking the photo will actually let you smile. There's a place out by Downingtown. And I, um, Smiley's Passports. No. No. Like, <laughs> you know, there's, a, <laughs> there's only a few places where you can get these photos taken. Like, you have to go out of your way to, to get your passport fo photo taken and have it submitted properly. The one out in Downingtown, the guy's cool. And he's like, yeah, you can smile. Don't worry about it. The guy down in Philly apparently is a bit of a stickler. Well, what, and you're not allowed to smile. Wait, Nick, do you have any idea? I as swear. To, is, is there is there actually though in effect a uniform rule or suggestion that, that, to that you not smile? They, I guess they want you to look the way you would look generically when you're angry and traveling. Yeah, when you're trying right, exactly. to, <laughs> when you're standing in line, an act of terrorism. <laughs> when you're yeah. standing in line at the, you know, but when the I TSA. hand over, don't when you guys hand over your ID, don't you just smile sort of naturally just to be polite? Like, yeah. Hi, hey, yes. how you doing? Right. So I think that that's why this guy says it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm usually like, hey. hey. <laughs> my issue is that in my passport photo, I'm wearing wax lips, yeah. and so I have to and that you're bring them allowed. with me. Hey, Come yeah. November 1st, you won't be able to do that, Steve. An announcement on the State Department website explains this change will help eliminate glares and shadows that can lead to delays in processing visas and passport applications. Applicants may wear glasses what? only in rare circumstances of documented medical necessity during urgent travel. All right. Face uh, I don't know why I'm asking, but I'll ask. Uh, facial recognition ID programs, are they um, foiled by glasses? I, I tend to think not, right? Because they, they scan like 180 or 200 different points on the face. Mm. So, but, you know, would, would glasses throw off facial recognition? I don't know, but facial recognition software is pretty wild because you even use it on your on your Xbox One or whatever Isn't you walk wild? in. It knows who it lab labels and put your yeah. if there are three or four people in the room and they're registered, Boom. their name pops up above their head and on Facebook and it's live video on Facebook too. Yeah. Well, on Facebook, when you go to like tag people, yeah. it already tags it already for tags you. them. It says hi, Stephen, when I come in when I sit down in the uh, the you Xbox. Love that, oh, don't I you? love it. <laughs> Case, except there's one one of my girlfriends uh, gets tagged as this guy that I'm friends with on Facebook all the time. Uh oh, that's got to be totally. insulting. I'm like, how are you? How are you, Chuck? <laughs> Who's that man face, Katie? <laughs> <laughs> Is there a Katie that you know? Katie? There is a Katie, and she's going to be so offended because I you don't know who she I is. Don't. And she's going to be like, why did he call me man face? I think I look pretty. <laughs> I don't know. It's not man face, Katie. <laughs> So is is the girl mannish looking or is the guy <laughs> girlish really looking? Pretty is is the guy really? Uh, hey, my name is Chuck. The guy's not pretty. Calmly, as they say. The guy's not pretty. He's oh, not pretty. Ooh, sorry to hear that. <laughs> okay. Bye.